Hey, how's it going guys? Shripro here and Google's Autodraw is a machine learning based artist. So what is it? Let's check it out. Google's blog defines it as Autodraw, a new web based tool that pairs machine learning with drawings created by talented artists to help you draw. Basically, Google Draw is a simple way to draw. You know what? If you are not a good artist like me, then you can just go to Google Draw you can draw it and based on the machine learning of what it has learned from us on how we draw it would make a guess and it will show you all the sorts of guesses that it has like if you're drawing a box and with two wheels then it will show you a bus a car or whatever based on this thing on on the machine learning what it thinks it is it says it works on your phone computer or tablet and it's free so the next time you wait a second do you use tablet leave that so the next time you want to make a birthday card, party invite or just doodle on your phone, it will be as easy and fast as everything else on the web. If you didn't know about Google's AI experiment technology, I will leave a link in the description for you guys to go and check it out. It's a great way. There are a whole lot of projects that Google has made and they are linked in that website. So it is based on quick draw, the same technology it uses to guess what you are trying to draw. So in this video, I would be showing you the website where you can go and check it out. And it's really fun guys and if you want to read about that I, I will leave two links in the description go and check it out it's really crazy apart from that Google Swift also says that if you are an artist then you can submit your drawings uh, there's a link for that in the website too so you can go and submit your uh, designs if you are an artist so without any further ado let's go and check it out how Google auto draw works so guys uh, right now I'm going to draw a simple way uh, like just go with a box and by the way, here's the link. And I'll just complete it. I say I'm a terrible drawer. See, I'm like pretty much I didn't draw anything, so it comes up with a beautiful band. <laughs> Machine learning are good. Like humans have got to be you know what doing hard work a lot because machines are getting much more better than what we are look at this artist you are great these are great drawings by the way guys uh, you see there are two uh, pencil like uh, icons there one is says auto draw and another one it says draw so if you want to go and check the machine learning capability of the auto draw google's auto draw then you have to click the auto draw not the draw but pretty much draw doesn't do anything except you know just scaling up the size of the pencil that's it auto draw is much better let's draw a scenery look at that uh, this one looks much more better i'm going to add a shape of right not even <laughs> but I'm, I'm a lot confused right now uh, let's go with this mountain here and uh, is there a sun there? No. Let's draw a sun. Rainbow without any color. And uh, what else? Let's make a river. Guys, this is much better than what I thought it is. This is much better. And let's draw some shark. Well, there cannot be any shark in a river though. Oh. And a UFO. I'm really enjoying it. I think you can use it for your kids to, you know, try out how drawing is and getting into coding and all. This is really a good one. Nice job, Google. Remember, I say that you can actually go and uh, submit your uh, drawing, your art in the Google's auto draw. I'm just playing around with it. Let's go with some fills. Here. Oh, yeah. I'm just going to randomly fill it up. Not, not according to the rainbow one, but just like that. Uh, pretty much that's it, guys. This is how the auto draw uh, looks, and this is how it works. So if you want me to go much more technical on this, then do comment below. I'll try to make it possible. And uh, that's it. So guys, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did like this, give this video a thumbs up and do subscribe to the channel. I think it was an interesting thing to do and for you guys to see it. 
So if you are going to try it out, then do comment below how you used it and how interesting is that. And as always, hashtag thanks for watching and I'll talk to you guys in the next one. Be happy and stay positive.